Hello, this is Jessica. Hi there, Jessica. This is Ronathan calling from the corporate office with How Are You Doing? I'm um, good, thank you. How are you? I'm great, thank you. Reason for the call is I saw that you'd reached out to our team on social media with a complaint, and I just wanted yes. to touch base with you and kind of find out what happened. Yeah, so last week I filed a name change request via email, and it said I'd get a response back within two to three days, and I didn't. So I called today, but I couldn't get a hold of anybody who could actually help me. Huh. Because nobody on the phone can help with name changes, I was told, and that that it's a back office job and they don't have direct phone access. That's what I was told. Oh, gosh. I, I might have a supervisor here that can just deal with that <laughs> immediately for you. I, I'm sorry. You shouldn't get such a runaround for that. Um, okay. So, yeah, it was pretty frustrating. So I appreciate you reaching out. Oh, no problem. So I've currently got your name on your account listed as Jessica. Correct. And it should be Sika, which is what my... So long story short, first I got married right. um, and I haven't updated my name on the record yet, which is what I was trying to do. Okay. Okay. Um, um, but the car reservation is under Sika because I reserved it through work. So I do have a car reservation, but it's under the wrong last name. So it does not include my gold rewards program information. Okay. Right. I see. So we need to change yeah. the last name. So you want it to be Jessica Fecal. Is that is that right? Sika, S-I-C-A, yeah. And I did send an email on that. Okay. I sent an email with a copy of my marriage certificate. Okay. Uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to put you on a very brief hold, and I'm just going to speak to one of my supervisors and see if this is something we can just action immediately for you. Um, That'd be great. If you can just hold And then the... if the name's changed, it should sync up with my existing reservation, hopefully, since the name matches. Okay. Uh, perfect. Yeah, I've got someone on the line here. Can you hold for one minute and Thank I'll you. just see if we can get that done yeah. right away for you. Bear with me. Your call is very important to us. Please hold. Oh, hey, Ned, it's Ronathan in customer service. Hello. Hey, Ronathan, how's it going? Hey, good. Listen, I'm just sending you over a file now. Um, lady's on the phone. She's on, on the other line. She can't hear us, but she's been getting quite the runaround with just trying to do a simple name change. And I was just wondering if we could get it actioned. Just, just do it. It seems pretty simple. It just needs a supervisor's authorization code. So if you look at the file I'm sending over, it's under the name Jessica, and we just need to change that to Jessica Fecal, F-E-C-A-L, I believe, Fecal, like uh, Fecal Matter, okay. I guess. Yeah. Um, so if yeah, I could pass yeah. the customer through to you, if you could just change it to Fecal for me and uh, just confirm it with yeah, her. Yeah, I, I can do that. I, I, you know, it's such a pain, the new system. Like, we, we've had people calling in and, like, they they can't do it. I can definitely do it for it. It's not a problem. Change it to fecal. Going through now. Perfect. Thank you so much. Hello, is Hello? that Mrs. Fecal? Uh, yeah, Fecal. Hi, Miss Fecal. Uh, my name's Ned. I'm one of the supervisors here. And I understand uh, the the issue that you've had with your name change. Um, Correct. Yeah. And yeah. So I've already gone ahead and changed it. Uh, Ronathan uh, already filled me in on the details. So uh, Real, your name's quick, now. Though, set. I think he had my name wrong. It should be S is in Sam. I C is in Charlie. A it's Sika, and I think he was saying Sika. <laughs> uh, so I just want to make sure it's spelled right. Yeah. Uh oh. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Oh my goodness. No worries. No worries. No. So yeah, maybe I should have waited until I spoke to you. Uh, I kind of jumped <laughs> the gun here, because uh, I would have had I changed it to fecal. F e c a l. Oh. Uh. So oh. unfortunately, uh, we'll just. We'll leave it like that in the system. Is it okay if I set a reminder and I'll give you a call back to change it 
Uh, to, to what did you want? F I C A? F T C O? F C O? Yeah. S is in Sam. I. C is in Charlie. A. Okay, so I I could call you back in in roughly uh, ninety days, and we could we could change it back at that. Ninety that days. Point. I have a reservation on Monday, so that's not going to work because the reservation doesn't Ooh. match my information. It doesn't well, let you, you change just, the name change again, right? Well, when you get there, just tell them, you know the. I'm not sure what we can do because it's it's set in the system. Like once it saves, you, you can't change it again for 90 days. Like there's a hold on it. Um, oh, yeah. Uh, so I think I think is there any way that you could change your name? I think that's that's the simplest explanation here, or change your ID somehow, so that uh, no. just like if you like your oh, what if I give her a voucher code? Um, maybe you could do that because when you get there, you can do it. Um. I really well, wish we could get you some. Also, that it's not going to, I'm president circle and it's not going to match my status when I pick up the car. Well, the, that, that should be okay. Um, it, like, as long as if you could get some ID that said fecal, if, if your last name could be fecal on a piece of ID, health card, or like, so like something from your your company, like a security pass, because then you can yeah. say like, here's here's my security pass. You can see obviously my name's Fecal, but my ID it's a little different. Yeah. You know? Pardon? That's not gonna work. They can't know. That's that's not a good option. Okay. Um. Well, here's here's another problem that I'm just thinking of. You might lose your president circle because of the name change. Uh, like, and especially if we change it again, uh, they so that does sometimes reset. It's in the, it's in the terms and conditions. I don't know if anyone mentioned that to you. Which is uh, fine. I'd have to go to back to Delta because it's a benefit through Delta. So I would have to go back to them and have it reapplied. But. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, right. So it'd be a really good if you could. Days yeah, but like I was, I've I've already put a reminder on my computer to call you. Okay. I, I put a call, Miss Beagle, uh in ninety okay. days. Um. So I'll definitely follow up with you. Um. Can you wait 90 days to come and get your rental? Is that an option? Like, instead of, when did you say Monday? If we just put that <laughs> yeah. out 90 days. Yeah, you yeah, can do I mean, that. I need a car Monday, so I'm going to have to figure something out. Hmm. Um, I, I really, I don't want to lose your business. I think that you're a very good customer for us. You're in the president's circle. And I think that that there's there's got to be an option that can work for everyone here. Uh, Maybe somebody on the back side can override that. Can say you put the name in wrong and have them There's, there's one other option. We could give you a complimentary bus pass. Uh for any major city in America. No, that's right. Would that work for, for Monday? Okay. Uh, then maybe I can put you through to uh, another manager, but I don't know. I feel like this is one where you might have to figure it out when you go in in person. Uh, could I put you on hold for a minute? Sure. And, and I'll check with, with the manager. Okay. Your call is very important to us. Please hold.
show for Ron. Hey, Ron, we're, we're fucked, man. Oh, what happened? We, we put the wrong name on that lady's account. <laughs> oh, Mrs. Fecal. Yeah. Well, what name? Yeah, what no, name that was the put? wrong name, man. Huh? I put Fecal, but I, I put Fecal, but she says it's something else, and it's set for ninety days. Well, just change it. Can you change now it? Now she wants to talk. No, it's set for ninety days. There's no way it can be unchanged. She's fucked. She's gonna lose her president circle. She, it's gonna affect her credit rating. Like she's she's gonna be fucked. She doesn't even know how fucked she is. She's just a stupid fucking bitch, Ron. Wait a minute. And, Wait and a minute. Gonna... Did you charge her company account for the name change? Yes, I did. Hey, you guys know I can, is there a charge for I the can name hear you change? And I'm going to report this call. This is very inappropriate. Well, look. Um, what I would do, listen, buddy. I, I, I would escalate this up to Hazel, um, but just tell her. Like, like, fob her off. Just tell her you've changed the name and it's all fine. She won't find out till she goes down there on Monday, and hopefully Hazel can like get something together before then. So just oh, tell her, Hazel, tell her it's, just tell I'll, her it's I'll all fixed. She won't know. Hazel. Yeah. No, no, okay, no. that's what I'll try no, no, no. to do. Go, that. go yeah. back on the line and just tell her it's all fixed. Like, tell her it's done. Okay, she won't know. Just tell her it's okay. tell her it's done. That's it, and then we'll figure it out after that. We've got till Monday before that bitch goes down there. So just, just, just. Say whatever. Tell her it's done. Fixed. Yeah, because if I put her through to Hazel, Hazel's fucking on my case. Like, I could lose my job on this one, but... She's not going to notice the charge for, like, 48 hours, because it doesn't it doesn't show on your statement for, like, 48 hours. I know that. So, yeah. So, yeah, right. just get rid of her. Get rid of her. Fuck it. It's, <laughs> it'll, it'll be the weekend before she even realizes anything's wrong. Yeah, fuck this bitch. All right, thanks, All right. Ron. Hello, Miss Fecal. It's Nettie here. I, apo I well, apologize. I apologize for the hold. What, what was your name again? My name is Ned. Nettie. Nettie. And who was the supervisor? Ron something. I'm sorry. No, Ron was my uh, was a initial representative. I just talked with Hazel while you were on Got hold it. there. Thank you. Hazel's thank you. my man. Hold on. Hold on, please. Hold on, please. Thank no, you for no, giving no, me your name. I heard no, everything I got... you said on hold. I'm going to what? file a complaint against you and your boss or whoever else was on the phone. Why? I heard you swear. I Why heard you call you me that? a fucking bitch. And you are lying what? to me. So you're going to be reported. Goodbye. No, 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 no. Don't do that. Don't do that. Hang on. I'll, I'll fix everything. Ms. What Beagle, did you do to my wife? What did it. you just say? Oh, I'm so sorry. I, I apologize <laughs> for everything. It's all an it's Is all this an being accident. recorded? I, is this yes, being recorded? maybe. Um, let me check the recording status here. Uh, I can put you through to my manager, and my manager can fix everything. But I, I'm really sorry. Like, but why didn't you fix it though? Uh, well, it wasn't my my fault. Your your recording wife gave me the wrong it. name. Okay, but okay, send me to your manager recording right now, please. Deleted. And what's your name? I'm gonna write it down. I need your name in. Uh, I'm I'm Mac. Mm -hmm. No, you said you were Ron. Ned E. Is Ned E? Yeah. Are you Ned E or Mac? Ned. She's Ned E. Nettie Nettie That's Mac. Ned Nettie McNamara is my name. N E D D Y McNamara. I go by Nettie or Mac, but we can talk to the manager, Hazel. You just let her know it was Mac. She that's how how I go by with her. Okay, um, yeah, please transfer me. Okay. Fuck Your call bitch. is very important to us. Please hold.
I, don't, I wish I could have reported that conversation. Yeah. I don't know how many times I need to go, but this is so bad. Retweet that. Like, put, put that on. So, yeah. No, you need to. It's insane. She's like, yeah, I have that. That's my phone. She doesn't. She can't hear it. Yeah. Yeah. Hi, you you speak you're speaking to Hazel. How 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 may how may I help you? Hi, Hazel. And what is your last Hi. name, please? My name is Hay- Hazel. My last name is. is are, are you ready? Yep. It's Hardeck. A H A R D A C C Hardeck. How okay, how. Um, how and many help you today, ma'am? Who, who transferred you? Who transferred us here? Uh, uh, I was transferred by a uh, uh, c- 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 customer service rep, Ned, and, and Ron, 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 Ronathan, and Nettie. Okay, and you're a manager? Yes, I, I am. The, I'm the manager of the call center. Danger. That's amazing. Thank you. Okay, so um, I my wife is next to me. I have to pull the phone off because she was about to hang up. Um, what? So you're two people. Say that, say that again. Say that again. May, may, may um, I say that again? Who's next to you? My wife, Jessica. This is Jessica, who originally called in. Yes. Who who, so, who are you? What what is your what is your name, ma'am? My name is Sarah. But the reason I am talking to you is because she was about to hang up. So your friends, Ron and Nettie, called my wife a fucking bitch. My friends? They're they're not my friends, ma'am. Those will be my employees. Great. Well, your employees called my wife a fucking bitch. We have a bit of a poltergeist situation going on here, don't we, Sarah? A bit of a poltergeist type situation here, don't we? What? I don't. Please go ahead with with your concerns. My concern is that they messed up her name change, and she okay. won't be able to get a car when she gets to her location. She okay. overheard because they didn't put her on hold. Ron and Ned talking about how she was effing screwed when she picks up, but she won't know until she's there. Okay. Okay. Let me try. And then and they it, called it, her an y'all. F and B word. And I hope that that call is recorded and you can listen to it. Well, let me just try and help you. So I, I need to speak to the to the person who is the primary She's account right holder. That's I believe, me. I'm right here. That's Miss Fekel. Fucking bitch. Not, excuse me. Fucking bitch. Who am I speaking to? Hello. This is Jessica. Jessica. And and was I speaking to your husband or I I don't know. My wife. I'm very confused right now. Some swearing going on. Um, We are not swearing. We are talking about what your employees did to me. Which is very inappropriate and could be a lot. Uh, my so employees you don't. Fix this or my, not? I certainly want to assist you, but I'm very confused. I've never had a call like this before. You know, uh, neither have I. Let, you, have we. let me start from the beginning, real quick. I'm going to give you a quick summary. Okay. I filed a complaint on Twitter because I wasn't getting help, and <sighs> Ron called me to try to. Excuse re- me. <clears throat> Can I just Can ask, ma'am? ma'am. Ma'am, this is Ron. I'm still on the line. I just wanted to confirm a quick detail. You said you're her wife, right? 
No, no, you're talking to Jessica. You, I am you, right here. We're both you, here. We're you, both listening. You just, and you, recording. you just, you just both well, said. When you were, when you were talking you just, to Nettie, ma'am, you, you just, guys you, just both, you just both, you just, you just both repeatedly said that that's your wife. Are you the one with the beard in the proposal picture that you posted on Twitter? What? On your Twitter page, there's what? a picture of your is proposal, it a real and it, right now? it's because this it's, lawsuit is going to be crazy. This is very well, why are you why are you pretending to be her wife when you're married to a guy called? Make Sorry, that up. We're taking this recording, and we're going to come. But why why recording. would you make that up? I'm very curious. I, I know you're both what, fat Mary? and ugly, but like, there's no need to pretend to be a dyke, you know? Fucking bitch! How dare you? Run, fuck these bitches. Let's go fucking smoke a joint. Ma'am, man. there's a lot. This this is not an acceptable way to talk to our customer service staff. Oh, look, if I, I was going to be rude, I'd say that that proposal picture would have looked a lot better if she wasn't as fucking wide as she is tall. Now, that's rude. But I didn't say that because I'm trying to be professional here. Ron, you're such a professional. You deserve a promotion. Thank you. Break time, Jessica, Hazel. We're Jessica, going for smoke. I, I'd like to speak to Jessica, please. I'm right here. You take care of that. Hi, Jessica. I, I would really like to help you. So let's just not listen to these silly men and put it all aside. It's not my fault let's, she has an ass like two badly parked Volkswagens. That's got nothing to do. She's a president's circle jerk customer, okay? That she's got nothing to do with her size or whatnot. Ma'am, how may I help you? Hey Hazel, so you gotta yes. hold on. you gotta you gotta fix your stutter. Um, go see a oh. therapist. Hey Ron, go fuck yourself in the ass. All right, fatty. Yeah. All right, fatty. Don't get all mad about it. I'm not all mad, but you guys, this is being recorded, and y'all are like trying to. You're right. It's circle jerk. You guys are circle jerking each other. Hey, at least we can reach that T Rex. Oh, there she goes. You guys on the circle jerk. <laughs> Okay. <laughs>